The crime rate in this country is continuing to fall. The FBI reported today that violent crime fell 5.5% last year. That's three years in a row now. Justice correspondent Bob Orr takes a closer look at the numbers and why crime is down. Bob? Well, Harry, these latest numbers from the FBI are surprisingly good. In 2009, violent crime fell sharply in every region of this country and in every statistical category. For example, rape dropped more than 3%. Assault, more than 4%. Robbery declined 8.1%, and murder fell more than 7%. Now, some of the largest drops were recorded in the largest cities, with murders down more than 11%. Washington, Las Vegas, Dallas, and Philadelphia, just among the cities, reporting declines. There were a few major cities which bucked the downward trend. Detroit and Newark, for example, saw an increase in murders in 2009. And this is interesting. Smaller cities had bigger problems. In cities with 25 to 50,000 people, murders were actually up more than 5%. As for secondary categories, burglary, larceny, property crime also all fell in 2009, as did auto theft and arson, which both dropped by double digits. Now, criminologists say better community policing and improved technology help drive those crime rates lower, but experts are cautioning us that police budget cuts in tough economic times could reverse that trend. In fact, in the first four months of this year, murders are already slightly up in New York, Chicago, and Los Angeles. Harry? Bob Orr in Washington tonight. Thanks.